hello friends welcome to youtube explore channel today we'll be learn about few things which are very helpful and effective in your database maintaining because each time you have to mention serial number against your database in order to count the database or you have to add mr mrs master in front of name manually against each name but here you don't have to worry about such thing you just have to mention the name and you have to select it and you have to follow a data step only and how to add border automatically for recording data in spreadsheet because you don't have to worry here that this is the data and you have to just select it and go up over here and then use the border but here you will be learn about such thing you just have to mention your data and your border comes up automatically and how to make your database letter names uh, in uppercase lowercase or proper because here you can see from here the rocky name the alphabet of the first name is in lowercase but here it is in proper case so how you can do this all things just by using your some keys you will be able to learn and maintain your work effectiveness for longer time and always able to get a great efficiency in your work as well so here you don't have to worry about such things so let's start you have to just mention the first two six figures like it either you can double click over here if you don't do this you just have to drag it down here and you will be able to see that the serial number has come up automatically and now our next step is to add mr or mrs master in front of each name so we will do in three steps here we will have seen this is the name of a male who are adult and we will be using mr against the name so what you can do is either you can press right click and go to format cell and here you have to go to custom or you can click here in the alignment you see this symbol just click on this sign then you have to go to number and here you can go to custom what you have to do is when you go to custom come up over here in the blank area double inverted comma then shift m capital mr dot and again inverted comma now give two spaces and press shift at rate you will see here that your name this appear like this way if you don't give space here it will come closer to the dot so you have to give the space according to your need the time being I'm just giving two spaces here and pressing OK this is how you can add mister against the adult name and now we have come up with ladies and to add females I just click on this sign click on number click on custom come up over here double inverted comma m capital misses dot inverted comma two space and press activate click ok so that's how you'll be able to do simple thing but in a very effective manner for your work here you have to mention the first name of the person to identify the gender mr or mrs miss master so this time we'll be writing master as we just pretend that these are the kids or children so what we do here is what comma master inverted comma tool spaces then add the read click ok so you can see how this has come up make sure when you selecting your data you go over here and then custom then here the first alphabet you press should be capital all right friends so that's how you can add the data mr or mrs master and further we'll be going to add border automatically what you have to do is you have to select the first row then go to condition formatting go to new rule and here use a formula to determine which cells to format just click over here then press equal to now friend you can see this 
this cell name is B3 and you can see in the name box as well so what you have to do is you have to press here equal to B3 so B3 has been locked here so what you have to do is you have to remove this dollar sign which comes after the B and then you have to shift arrow greater than equal to zero it means if this value here whatever it is the value but it should be greater than zero then what happens you have to go to format click border click outline it means your data will be displayed with the border so I have to place OK OK now you can see your data has come up with border again select your data go to condition formatting now this time just go to manage rules and here you can see our first one formula is equal to dollar b dollar three colon dollar e dollar three so our data is here but we need each and every data to be border so what I could do here do here I just mentioned that whatever I fill from B3 to E100 it should come border automatically so until now we have our data up to B17 but we need it up to E100 so we will do small thing here so friend I just means I have collected this one B3 to E100 and now click on OK so you have seen the data has come up with border now now this time I don't have to go anywhere I just have to press 16 is the next number and the data border comes up so you can see that's how automatically your border comes up you don't have to worry about but you have to select this then you have to go over here and select border automatically or you have to click on the options available here in the slide bar of borders so friends our last work is how to make first letter of name uppercase lowercase or proper so right now you have seen this if I click here I select first three names now I press shift control and then press P it means the first letter of the name John and Cena J and C has been come up with capital letter the first letter only so that is called the proper function if I press shift control then L it comes up again to lowercase if I press shift control and U it comes up in uppercase so for the time being I just click on P again and I'll do shift control P but how can you do this because excel dot dynamic is such kind of function where you can just press shift control and p you need the coding here so what you have to do is friend you have to go to developer site i have mentioned the code here as well, as well. you just have to click on insert then click on module and here you have to paste your data in your module for the time being i have already module 2 where i have pasted the data coding so this is the coding you just have to write this coding in your module you can view this is for uppercase this is for proper case and this is for lower case once you edit this coding here you just have to cross close this one now you have to go to view and in view you have to go to macros here you have to go to view macros now you can see here it comes up with lower upper and proper if you click on proper now go to options here what you have to do here is when you enter the coding in module you just have to press L here means lower case then OK then select proper go to options and press here P you have to mention P here I have already added that's why the P comes up because I used this function earlier as well so I'm just telling you right now you have to mention P otherwise you won't be able to use the function and now you have to press on upper 
and click on options come up here press u and click ok and then close it so next time i have to mention any name for instance will son friends you can see the function has used wilson with master but this person name is mr wilson so i can go back here go to alignment and go to number go to custom and here i can recorrect it if i want to this function has excel has used the earlier row cell function that's why it has come up with mr so this is very effective and efficient for your working as well where you can use how to add serial numbers automatically adding mr or mrs master in front of names then adding border automatically whenever you add new data the border comes up automatically and how to use uppercase lowercase buffer because excel don't have such function for the time where you can add or use uppercase lowercase and proper function i hope you like the video friends please like and share explore youtube channel so i can bring up more videos for you thank you for watching my video thank you thanks